You know, it's been an awful long time since I've done a vlog. As you can see, I'm walking through a forest right now. I'm actually visiting my aunt and uncle in Palgrave, Ontario. They're living in a gated community. They just moved here like two months ago. It's really nice. Like, oh. This is all up on their property. It's so nice. There's actually a golf course right around here. I'm gonna try and find it. Wish me luck. Yeah, I guess while I'm exploring, I can tell you a little bit what happened with my life over the last few months, considering I haven't, like, actually spoken to you in so long. So, as you can see, I got a haircut. That's number one. That's a pretty big one, I think. To me, it is. It's a little different from the uh, shag I had going. Also... No, that's not the golf course. Uh, I'm almost done school now. I've got, like, two weeks. If that, a week and then exams kind of thing. Hopefully, once school's done, I'll be pumping out videos like fucking, I don't know. I was going to say candy, but it's not really the right word. Uh, is this the golf course? I don't, I don't even know at this point. It's, it's green. I'll give you that. Uh, so, okay, I have choices now. I can either go this way or this way, but I'm this way looks more golf coursey. This way looks more rustic woodlandsy. I have no idea which way to go. So after careful consideration, I've decided to go towards the golf coursey area. Um, mind you, careful consideration was actually like two seconds in real life. So about the same amount of time it took for me to change shots in this video. Uh, however, as I'm going along, no trespass, obviously. There's a fence there. Let's not trespass. And... Fantastic. If you guys can still hear me over the wind, then let me tell you that I have hit a dead end. Or what looks to be a dead end. So this is what I've just walked into. It's a big pile of nothing. Uh, this trail goes down here and then over there and then it stops so yeah looks like I might be able to go over that way though but do I want to try that hmm short answer is yes I'm going to go this way uh, hopefully no one will yell at me because I have no idea what I'm doing I'm chemistry dog incarnate uh, I have no idea where I'm going. Okay, so that back there definitely looks like a golf course. But this way over here leads to another path. In fact, again, if you can hear me over the wind, I think this path is the same path that I decided not to take. It just happened to go around that building. In fact, that looks to be the exact case. So, let's see what happened. I, whew, I see geese. Geese are nice. Uh, yeah. So this is the path that I just came on to. Pretty sure this path is the one that I could have taken over that way and then just came out over here. Okay. So I'm going to go this way, I'm going to go into your face, and uh, see where this path leads. It seems to go around, go around this like little pond, and there's geese in the pond, which is nice because geese are awesome. Uh, that's a really damn nice pond. I guess it should be nice considering, you know, it's 
golf course. Uh, <sighs> let's see. Yeah, there's nothing else really of interest over here. It's going to be fun finding my way back to my aunt and uncle's house. This is going to be great. Okay, so this is the pond I was talking about. You can't really see it, but there are geese like right here. Somewhere in this area. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is a green, considering the, you know, the green. Uh, I'm going to walk around there now. And you guys will see me in like two seconds when I'm over there. So, just wait those two seconds and I'll be over there. By this point, two seconds have inevitably elapsed and I'm pulling up onto that green. Unfortunately, the closer I got, the birds flew away. Or at least the ducks did. The geese are still here. I'm going to see if I can get close to them. And whether they're as crazy as the ones at Waterloo University. Geese at Waterloo are fucking insane. So, oh, they're swimming away. Oh, well, at least I can get them on video for you. See, I wasn't lying. There are geese. They're swimming away, though. It makes me very sad because I like geese. Especially Canada geese. Don't know about you uh, Americans out there, but uh, here in Canada... We love these fuckers. Don't know why I decided to take an American accent in order to say something to the Americans, but it happened, so, uh, here are them geese. And, uh, I'm gonna go back to being Canadian. I've made an interesting discovery now. So, we all know that geese like to shit, because, face it, who doesn't like to shit, really? But, no, just geese in general. And it turns out that geese apparently don't like to shit on the actual green. All of the long grass is pretty, pretty shitty, for lack of a better word, but not so much on the actual green. So, if you're in an area where geese shit on everything, cover your lawn in green, in golf green, because looks like they don't like it. Maybe they don't like it how it feels on their feet, or maybe they just prefer to shit on the long grass that's right beside it. Who knows? No, Paul. No. Now is not the time to be daring and go down yonder path. Because it's Easter and I should probably go home. But yonder path is so inviting. I'm at a crossroads, guys. Literally and figuratively at this point. <laughs> So, uh, I'm going to take out a decision nickel. Heads, I'm going that way. That way. Tails, this way. And hopefully no one will see me talking to my phone. Because that would be strange. Then again, I really don't care, so... Whatever, decision nickel. Heads that way, tails that way. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> For a second I thought I didn't have a nickel. That would have been terrible. That would have been a catastrophe at this point. Looks like my adventure has come to an end. At least when it comes down to that path. For I have decided to throw this. Tails it is and up the path I go. Kind of disappointing, but the decision nickel rules all. <sighs> you know, actually, that's something that... Uh, one of my exes really hated. Used to throw a lot of decision nickels around, because... Hey, it's easier than making my mind up myself. Leave it all to chance. My phone is talking to me, but I will answer them in a moment. So, decision nickel used to be my go-to thing. My ex-girlfriend got really pissed off at me. Thus, decision nickel died for a while. But, considering I've been single for a year now, I've been able to get a lot of use out of the decision nickel, and so far it hasn't done anything bad to me. Hopefully today follows that trend. Hopefully. So the decision nickel done me good. I'm back here. Would you look at that? And apparently, according to the text message I just got, 
more people are arriving. So I'm going to have to cut this short here. It's unfortunate, but probably been long enough. I hope that you guys have enjoyed this walk through the woods. And I hope that you guys enjoy my channel. Until then, I'll see you guys later. Stay average.